need to rotate back round quicker than we have been but we'll deal with that later but the most important thing is we need forward runs we can't leave the pivot isolated uh Doug, anything um uh, just you know we have limited time together so this is another opportunity obviously win the game we need to as well but also you probably should be have the same intensity in that first minute as we did in the 40th because this is a chance to we'll work on all the things that rob's saying we just got to trust in it give 100 percent. and then other thing is for those that don't know there's a rivalry between Helvetia and Baku for a few years, so they'll be up for it, so expect a tough game, don't think it'll be easy.
When you move off the ball, it must be more enjoyable. The last yeah, fucking man. five, six minutes compared to fucking 15 minutes where we were so sluggish on the ball, we ended up having to do a trick or a chip pass every time just to get out of fucking pressure against them. That ain't, that ain't acceptable for a group of players as good as you and as experienced as you. It's not, it's not like you're young players. You know how to play this game. You have to move without the ball. I understand we've got into habits, some of us, of not moving without a ball or doing it with less intensity, okay? But we have to get back into the habit. The last five minutes was a good sign, but now it has to continue for 20 minutes. <coughs> yes, move off the ball with intensity, offer for a pass, and you will kill this team. Kill them. Okay, very simple. I'm not even going to show you anything on there. Just move quickly without the ball and keep trying to make, trying to make yourself available. And you will kill them. That's it. No, I didn't say about boys, when we start going down, you see people getting frustrated and that, and we can't do that, we've got to stick together and just because people get frustrated, so we make bad decisions, we get more frustrated and we come in a vicious cycle, um, circle, and be back we can get away with it, but if we're playing in NFS, we're not going to get away, we have to stick together as a team. Um, two tactical points, the goalie keeps throwing it long, so let's drop, okay we go to the game with a game plan, but then we've got to read what's happening and adjust to that. Other point is, Especially on this pitch, it's very slow. Don't get 2-2 two, two and really far. If you are, this player's on the ball and you're hit on the other side, go drop and go as a support. And maybe you can do a 1-2 or you can go to the parallel. But don't leave a separate there space because that player's probably not going to penetrate it or if he plays it, it's going to get intercepted. So those are two tactical ones, but let's stick together as a team, man. We've got a long season ahead. Let's just trust in the game plan, trust in our teammates and we'll come back and we'll always win the game.
Это был мяч, Okay, stop what you're doing. Stop, 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 stop. Just stop for a second because you're not going to listen while you're doing all your things. Okay? You know the last five minutes, stop. The last five minutes were nowhere near acceptable. Okay? People doing their own thing, stopped moving with any purpose. Like Doug, the most experienced player here, part of the coaching staff, I dug him out for it. But it was happening everywhere. He passed the ball. And yeah, he's jogging back to the wing to open. But they're sprinting to close you down, so something doesn't add up there. And that's why you're going to struggle. The other team's going to sprint and you're going to jog. It doesn't matter how much better than them you are on the ball, you will lose if we keep doing that. It can't be for five minutes. And I don't think it was fitness. I don't think it was fitness. I thought it was attitude that stopped you moving quickly with purpose. Okay? It has to fucking be for a lot longer of the game. Otherwise, your, your individual minutes will suffer. Because trust me, some of you are going to fucking... I know when Charlie's fit enough, he's going to run hard for the fucking minutes he's on. I know certain players are going to do that. Zach. I know certain players are going to do that, okay? If you're not willing to do that, your minutes are going to suffer because of it. We need to be good without the ball. I, again, you're all very good with the ball. The best players in the league. It's hard to say what players from any of the other teams we'd want over any of you guys for what you do on the ball. But what you do off the ball has to match them in intensity. Not in smartness, because you've got that anyway, but in intensity, okay? It has to. Can't pick and choose your moments that you're going to play. Uh, Doug, anything? No, I'd say, yeah. Boys, we, um, we know we're good players, but you can be good players with a good system of play. We've got to be good players with a good system, so just keep trusting in the system, keep working, let's keep going each game a little bit better. Uh, Reds? That's right. Go on. So, <laughs> silent, 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 isn't it? Too famous. You must be sacking me. Oh.